This was my biggest fear. Walked into the room, opened the door, and I saw about 25 people in the room. I almost turned around and couldn't do it. Three, two, one. I love public speaking. I love public speaking. I love public speaking. Okay, now it's time for the first round of impromptu. We'll be speaking for two minutes. And the topic goes, take challenges so that this is the only way for you to grow. When I was about to go on stage, something hit me, just like the anxiety, the fear. And I thought, oh, I can't do this. I paused and I said to myself, no, you can't keep running away like you've been doing for years and years and years. You have to face this fear. To give a great round of applause, CJ. You have to overcome it. Step in front of these people and speak. Deliver your message. I would say to me, doing this is a thrill. Being in front of strangers is a thrill. Some people want to challenge themselves through roller coaster rides or through doing something out of the comfort zone. But this to me is outside of my comfort zone and it's challenging myself. And, and I wouldn't say I'm a thrill seeker or, or chasing my thrills, but I just like challenging myself, challenging my mindset, getting better at things. Once you get comfortable with something and you don't get that thrill, then I would suggest find another thrill. Thank you. Doing a course like this, that fear and anxiety and adrenaline rush that I thought was a detriment to me actually turned into a thrill. And using it as exposure therapy has changed me, has got me thinking, wait, I could become a leader. I could inspire people. They're like empty vessels and they're waiting for me to fill them up with information and to make me think the world's my oyster. The shackles are off, I feel free.